You've tapped into the exact moment sky watchers are waiting for. Yes, this is the right video. A planetary alignment is coming and it's hiding more than just planets in plain sight. Discover which planets align, how to view them, and why this matters right now. Not all planetary alignments are the same. Astronomers classify them based on how many planets are involved. When three to five planets align in the sky, it's called a small or minor alignment. These happen fairly often every few years and are easier to catch with the naked eye. But when six planets appear aligned, we enter a rare category known as a large planetary alignment. These are far less frequent and offer a striking view of the solar system structure. And then there's something even more extraordinary, a great planetary alignment. This happens when seven or more planets gather along the same section of the sky. Great alignments are incredibly rare and have long fascinated both astronomers and sky watchers. The more planets that join in, the more powerful and humbling the display becomes, turning an ordinary sky into a cosmic masterpiece. On August 10th, 2025, six planets will appear to gather closely in the sky. This is called a large planetary alignment because six planets will join the parade. The planets won't form a perfect line, but they will seem to line up from Earth's view. This happens because of their positions along the ecliptic path. The alignment will be visible before sunrise. It is a visual event caused by the orbits of planets. People with clear skies can see it with their eyes. It shows how our solar system is always moving and changing. This special view brings wonder and joy to sky watchers everywhere. The alignment will include six well-known planets. Mercury will be close to the sun and may appear low in the sky. Jupiter and Saturn will be easy to spot because they are large and bright. Venus could be hidden in sunlight and hard to see. Uranus and Neptune will be too dim for the naked eye but can be observed with a telescope. These planets will line up along the ecliptic, offering a rare chance to see multiple worlds in one area of the sky together. Observing the alignment requires careful attention to timing, location and sky conditions. The best time to view the event will be just before sunrise, when the planets are above the horizon and the sky is still dark enough to provide contrast. Viewers should look toward the eastern sky with a clear, unobstructed view. Urban areas with heavy light pollution might obscure some of the dimmer planets, making it harder to experience the full display. Rural or high altitude areas are ideal locations. Weather will also play a major role. Clear skies are essential, as clouds can block the entire view. Planets like Jupiter and Saturn will be visible to the naked eye, but binoculars or small telescopes can enhance the view, especially for seeing Uranus and Neptune. Smartphone apps like Stellarium or Starwalk can help locate each planet accurately and track their movement during the morning. It's also helpful to arrive early, allowing time for eyes to adjust to the darkness. For the best experience, plan ahead, bring warm clothing if needed, and consider watching with a friend or astronomy group to share the event and make the moment more memorable. These events are based on predictable orbital cycles and are part of the natural rhythm of the solar system. While alignments vary in visibility and spacing, their repetition follows regular patterns over decades. Each alignment is slightly different depending on viewing angles and planet positions. August 2025 offers a particularly favorable one, making it a great opportunity for sky watchers and educators alike. To understand where the planets will appear in the sky during the alignment, astronomers use celestial coordinates called right ascension and declination. These are like longitude and latitude for the night sky and allow for precise tracking of each object's location. During this alignment, the involved planets will be positioned near the constellations of Leo, Virgo and Cancer, depending on your viewing location and time. Tools like ephemerides, charts showing celestial positions, and mobile apps such as Sky Safari, Stellarium or NASA's Eyes on the Solar System allow anyone to find the planets easily. These resources update in real time and can simulate the sky from any location, helping observers pinpoint where each planet will appear just before dawn. The angular distance between planets will be small enough that several will be visible in a single glance or frame through binoculars or wide-angle lenses. Mapping the planetary positions also offers an excellent way to teach orbital mechanics and how apparent motion is tied to Earth's rotation and revolution. 
Observing this alignment with coordinates in hand helps link what we see to the precise mechanics that govern our solar system. The 2025 alignment becomes not just a sky show but a guided tour through the paths of our neighboring worlds. The planetary alignment offers a stunning opportunity for photographers, both amateur and experienced. Capturing multiple planets in one frame is rare and visually impressive. The best time to photograph the event is just before sunrise, when the sky is dark but beginning to brighten slightly. A tripod is essential to keep the camera stable for long exposures. A wide-angle lens can help fit more planets into a single frame, especially when they form a soft arc across the sky. Using manual focus and high ISO settings improves results in low light. Photographers can use apps like Photopills or Stellarium to plan their shots and determine the exact position and timing of each planet's appearance. Including foreground elements like trees, mountains or buildings can add scale and artistic flair to the image. Light pollution should be minimized, so traveling to a dark sky location is ideal. Shooting in raw format allows more flexibility during editing. For advanced photographers, stacking multiple images can bring out faint planetary details while reducing noise. Even smartphone cameras can capture the event with proper stabilization and settings. Sharing these images can inspire others to observe the sky and appreciate astronomy. Whether you're documenting the alignment for science, education or beauty, this celestial event is a rewarding subject. The image you create may become a personal memory or a powerful teaching tool. It is a chance to blend art and science in one spectacular moment under the stars. Despite their massive size, the planets involved in the alignment have almost no effect on Earth's tides or gravity. Their distances from Earth are so vast that their gravitational pull is extremely weak compared to the influence of the Moon and the Sun. These two bodies remain the primary drivers of Earth's ocean tides. The alignment may look dramatic, but scientifically it produces no measurable force or change on our planet. Claims that planetary groupings alter gravity or disrupt natural processes have been proven false. This is a visual event, not a physical one. The Moon will be in its first quarter phase during the planetary alignment. This means it will appear half illuminated in the evening sky and will not interfere much with the early morning view of the alignment. Since the alignment will occur before sunrise, the moon will be setting or low in the western sky, reducing its effect on visibility. Its light will be less intense than a full moon, allowing darker skies for spotting dimmer planets like Uranus and Neptune. The moon's placement and brightness are favorable for observers. In some locations, it may even serve as a helpful guidepost when locating other planets in the sky. The moon will not obstruct any of the aligned planets or create glare that would diminish the view. For photographers and sky watchers alike, its presence may enhance the overall visual composition of the sky. Its subtle glow could complement long exposure shots and provide a beautiful contrast to the string of planets. During this alignment, the moon plays a quiet but supportive role, adding depth to the scene without drawing attention away from the main celestial event. There are many helpful tools for observing the planetary alignment. For beginners, the naked eye will be enough to spot the brightest planets like Jupiter and Saturn. Binoculars can enhance the view and help identify Mercury and Uranus under good sky conditions. For serious observation, a small telescope reveals more detail, such as Jupiter's moons or Saturn's rings. Astronomy apps like Stellarium, Sky Safari or Star Walk help locate each planet's position by simulating the sky from any location and time. These apps are free or low cost and work on most smartphones. Star charts and printable sky maps are also useful for planning observations ahead of time. For photography, tripods, remote shutters and wide angle lenses are valuable. A dark location with minimal light pollution greatly improves visibility, especially for fainter planets like Neptune. It is helpful to check the weather and bring extra gear like red flashlights, chairs or warm clothing. Some observatories and astronomy clubs may set up telescopes for public viewing events. Whether observing solo or with a group, these tools make it easier to enjoy and understand the event. With a bit of preparation, anyone can witness this rare sky moment and feel more connected to the cosmos. Planetary alignments, like the one on August 10th, 2025, do not cause any physical or gravitational effects on Earth, but their value lies in the chance to observe celestial mechanics in action. 
These events offer astronomers, educators and enthusiasts a rare opportunity to witness the predictable motions of the planets as they form elegant patterns in the sky. For scientists, the alignment is a visual confirmation of our models of orbital motion and a teaching tool to engage the public with real-time examples of planetary dynamics. Students can learn about concepts such as orbital resonance, angular separation and synodic cycles by observing the alignment. Amateur astronomers benefit from the chance to track and image several planets in a single session, especially with planets like Uranus and Neptune that are not always easy to locate. For astrophotographers, the alignment provides a creative challenge to frame multiple planets in one wide-angle shot, highlighting the harmony of the solar system. The event also stimulates public interest in space, offering a natural invitation to look up and explore. Even though the alignment has no measurable influence on our planet, it carries immense educational and inspirational value. It encourages people to ask questions, use tools like telescopes or apps, and connect with the cosmos in a hands-on way. It's a reminder that science can be beautiful, accessible, and deeply moving when we take the time to observe the universe around us. Many people mistakenly believe that planetary alignments can cause natural disasters or major shifts on Earth. This idea has been widely spread in movies, online videos, and social media posts, but it has no basis in science. The planets involved are extremely far from Earth, and their gravitational pull is too weak to have any measurable effect on tides, tectonic plates, or human behavior. Some also think alignments cause earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, or extreme weather, but extensive scientific studies show no such connections. These visual events are simply perspective-based patterns seen from Earth, not physical arrangements of massive bodies lining up in space. Another common myth is that these alignments are rare, once-in-a-lifetime events. In truth, smaller alignments happen every few years, and larger ones can be predicted far into the future using well-known orbital mechanics. Planetary alignments are awe-inspiring, but not dangerous. They offer a chance to appreciate the beauty and complexity of our solar system, not to fear it. Knowing the truth helps people focus on the educational and inspirational aspects instead of worrying about unproven threats. Throughout history, planetary alignments have fascinated civilizations across the world. Ancient cultures like the Babylonians, Egyptians, Mayans and Greeks carefully tracked the movements of planets and recorded alignments as significant celestial events. They often connected these groupings to omens, divine messages or the timing of rituals and harvests. Temples, calendars, and monuments were aligned with astronomical positions to mark such occasions. In medieval times, alignments were sometimes viewed with fear, thought to predict famines or plagues. As astronomy developed into a scientific discipline, these events were better understood as predictable and natural results of orbital motion. Despite the rise of modern science, the awe surrounding alignments has remained strong. In recent centuries, alignments have inspired artistic works, literature, and public gatherings. Today, they continue to be moments of cultural connection where ancient curiosity meets modern knowledge. Educational events, telescope viewings, and space documentaries often celebrate these rare groupings. The alignment will be another chapter in this long history, an opportunity for people around the world to look up, remember the past, and connect with the rhythms of the cosmos in ways both ancient and modern. The alignment provides a powerful platform for science education and outreach. Teachers can use the event to introduce key topics like the solar system structure, planetary motion and orbital mechanics. By observing the alignment, students gain a real-time connection to astronomical concepts typically taught in textbooks. Astronomy clubs and science centers can organize public sky-watching events offering telescopes and expert guidance. Planetarium programs may simulate the alignment, helping visitors understand what they'll see outdoors. The event encourages the use of scientific tools such as star maps, sky-watching apps, and telescopes. Educators can develop activities around predicting planetary positions, measuring angular distances, or comparing brightness among planets. It's also an opportunity to discuss the history of astronomy and how ancient civilizations interpreted similar alignments. Parents and children can enjoy the event together, fostering interest in science at home. 
sharing observations, sketches or photos online can make learning collaborative and exciting. This alignment turns the sky into a live classroom, reminding learners of all ages that science is not just about reading, it's about seeing, exploring and experiencing. Events like this build curiosity, promote STEM engagement and inspire the next generation of scientists and explorers. The planetary alignment is more than a sky event. It is a moment of shared wonder and discovery. People around the world will look up and see multiple planets gathering in the morning sky. Though the alignment is purely visual, it sparks learning, inspires questions and brings people closer to the beauty of the solar system. With no harmful effects and easy ways to observe, it offers something for everyone, from first-time sky watchers to experienced astronomers. It's a chance to slow down, observe and remember that Earth is part of something vast and magnificent. Just a quick note, disclaimer. As an Amazon and other affiliate, I earn from qualifying purchases at no additional cost to you. Do you like the video and want to make videos like this? Turn text into stunning videos in seconds. Get free trial and unlock your creative potential. You can create even better videos than mine, honestly. No editor is required. Check out the link in the video description below. Got thoughts or questions about the alignment? Drop them in the comments. We'd love to hear from you. And if there's a topic you want us to explore next, let us know. Your idea could shape our next video. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the planetary alignment. Please like and share the video and please do not forget to subscribe for more videos.